serious? I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know. <laughs> That's a bad way to open the stream. I don't know why I just started this. I'm not done setting up yet. Okay. I don't know. What I, I don't know what I exactly want to do today. It is a new month, and that excites me because that means there are tons more critters to find. Lots of new critters. And I love me some critters. I want to get a five-star island. Last time we checked, I was at three. And um, Isabel said the best way to improve that for right now is to decorate more with furniture items. So we're going to do a little bit more decorating. I don't remember where... Oh, no. Dobie lives where Frida used to, right? So Dobie should be down south from my house. I'm going to go say hi. Dobie, where are you? Oh, this is Hornsby. I'm on a snack run. Where's Dobie, then? Dobie! I can't wait to see what his house looks like. I can't take the anticipation. Whoa. Doby. You are scholarly. A bona fide resident like you. I, I don't understand the ohm catchphrase. But I still have a lot of unpacking to do. Can you come back tomorrow? This place will be ship shaped by then. Oh, Doby. I like you. I'm kind of liking our cast of characters we've got here. Pretty solid group. Unfortunately, the only one that I don't really have any positive feelings for is Caroline. I just can't help it. Like, I'm sorry if that's like your favorite friend in the world i just think she's kind of boring <laughs> she just kind of like is there hedge sculptures that's like a like a rich yard thing and then i remember what the fuck am i looking at right now man they gave him such a fun personality it's the eyes dude they really nailed that like lifeless look of like the eyes are dead on but they're like slightly angled in differing directions and they like they gave him like eye brows you see that like purple bit but only at the top it's just not expressive enough a oh, lucky old bunny yippity yipper here's a little tip you can call me zipper yay you can clap now no really go on you have great personality but you freak me out well, well, isn't this swell? Here you are, and here I am to tell you all about my favorite holiday. I know what you're thinking. No, this is not a costume. And don't you go snooping, got it? Zippity zap, enough of that. You're funny. It's almost bunny day. Hop, hop, hooray. It's my favorite time to come out and play. Ugh, I've got so much prep work to do. I hope you can keep yourself busy. And guess what? This funny bunny has a bunny day secret just for you. Ready? Oh, I'm so ready. Yippity skippity, here it is. My wiener. The time has come. Let's look for eggs. That's my bunny plan. Oh, I have so many, dude. They're everywhere. They're here. They're there. They're everywhere. Find them if you can. Did I make myself clear? Yes? No? Maybe so? And here's a little something I made for you, too. Okay. <laughs> it's supposed to be for a bunny day bed. I don't want that. Zippity, skippity, hoppity, hey. It's gonna be the wonderfully wonderfulest bunny day. I'm probably not gonna touch this game until next Sunday, just so you know, but I love your attitude. Okay. What, what am I doing? What, what, what's wrong with me? Okay, let's, let's, let's look at all the... Let's grab all the furniture that I have in my storage that I could put out in the world. And it doesn't look stupid. Uh, and then let's take a leisurely scroll. I forgot about my ugly ass rug. Take a leisurely scroll through our DIY list. None of these can... Oh, wait, the height... Oh, I had a baby bottle on it. I was going to say, if it's big enough and doesn't have a baby bottle, I could play it off as a lifeguard chair and put it on the beach. But nay, the study desk is super cute. I'm just going to throw that like in my second room. Garden lantern, yeah. That could look cute for sure. Park clock definitely needs to go in our park sector. What are we playing jokes? Uh, candy machine? I don't know what to do with that. Microwave is fun. The formal paper is rad. I don't know why it's here and not on the walls. Boom! <laughs> why did it send it to the stratosphere? Why is it at the very top? Stupid moron. Why is this in my inventory? Whatever, I'll throw it in here. I like the color. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw everything down and then we're gonna go into decorator mode and fiddle with it. We're gonna we're gonna lower this a little bit. Here you go. I'll just leave the radiator on that wall. It's fine. I'll just put it in the corner. And then we're gonna put the locker here. <laughs> home sweet home. Man, what a time to be alive. So this is our like park area that we haven't quite realized yet. Uh, I, I just don't know what I want to do with it, really. But I think I think it's going to be, like, a little path around the pond. And we're going to have some flowers around the pond. And there's going to be a park clock right here. That's the one thing that I'm going to go ahead and commit to. And then there's going to be, like, benches and shit. And there's going to be, like, flowers around it. I don't know if I like the clock on the water. That looks awkward. I don't think anyone would ever do that. Hmm. Whatever. We're going we're gonna to do it. F it. All right, let's see what this this glow garland is. I, I want to hang it over my bed. Yeah, whatever. Sorry, I raised my voice. There's no room. I've monopolized every wall. And I don't want to put it in the other room because this is my, like, cool decorated room. Uh, okay. Let's do it. This way. That's pretty cute, actually. 
That might stay there literally forever. Because <laughs> that's really cute. Um, okay. What else What else was I going to put in here? Log chair, drinking fountain, log chair. Oh, the, the shower set. That's right. What the hell does the shower set look like? Let's just put a freaking shower next to the locker in the next room. Let's, let's make this face in a way where you can see the face of it. Hell yeah. All right, let's put a shower on the wall as you enter. Yup. Can I turn it on? Yup. Looks good to me. All right. Uh, let's see. Who's gets the patio? You have this cool setup going on. Well, who gets the patio? Who's gonna have a lovely patio? Is it gonna be you? Is it gonna be you? Is it gonna be you? It's gonna be Marlo. Marlo would throw the most rambunctious barbecues, wouldn't he? Agree with me right now, or else you're not a real fan. I'm freezing cold. I'm gonna turn off my AC. Let's remove this tree. Hurt. Patio. Okay, uh, how do I do this again? There you go. Should I start up the Island Designer app? Hell yes, you should. Let's F word this B word up. Okay, what color is patio? What material? Stone. Y'all don't get to say. How close to the house can I make path? That? Okay. I don't have to do. No. Okay, the thing is though, there's not enough space between these houses. I want it to be like obvious that this is Marlo's patio. Not Vivian's or whoever lives there. Either Vivian or Bam. Can't remember which one. Oh, we can find out. We can visit. It's Vivian. Okay, well, let's go ahead and put down the oven. And then we'll mold everything else around it. We'll just move stuff around. Doesn't have to look perfect right away. You just need to get stuff on the ground. Get started. That's as close as it can get to the... Pizza! Sorry, I got excited. Um, that's a hazard. Uh, I love how this looks, though. I just need to figure out where all my paths are gonna live. That needs to move. Uh, that tree right there. Back to work. Oh, I love this view. This is what I needed. Oh, it's gone. And then we're gonna put a chair back here. Nice! Look at this freaking patio! This is kind of, you can sit down. Can you, can you not sit in it? There you go. Lovely, lovely. I do have room, so I can delete all this, all these pads. Okay, let's do that. Uh, and then I'll, and then, so it'll be like a, a little, oh, man. How sick is this? Oh, I need one of those. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Inspiration just struck me like a truck strikes a kid in the middle of the road. I should be a poet. Your home now has another room. Hell yeah, it does. Oh. Shit. The lattice fence is super cute. We're grabbing that instantly. Oh, flower bed is super cute. That's great for in front of people's houses. I'll grab a flower bed. I'm going to spend all my nook miles on this. The bench is happening for sure. The bench is definitely happening. Honestly, I kind of want two of them, but I'm not going to go ahead and pull the trigger on that because I'm running low on miles here. Because the main thing I want, I don't know if it's they still have it. Yes. Party lights. That's what I want. I want to put this by the patio, dude. Screw off, asshole. I'll be fought of a plane and die. Thank you for your patronage. No bad thoughts. No bad thoughts. Well, I can't do the pretty lights. They wouldn't have come until tomorrow anyway, but I have to wait two days for the pretty lights. Drats! I wanted to put them right here and it would look cute. Harumph. Time travel is always an option. Yep, and it's an option I'm going to use in like five seconds. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I'm just gonna place my last few furniture items and then move on with my day. Outdoor picnic set still needs to go somewhere. Maybe we can put that next to the campsite. Or right here. This is the picnic zone. This is where people like to picnic. Now I just need, is there like, can I put like a little blanket outside to put that on? Is that doable? I could probably do it manually with like a custom design, but I don't really want to do that. It's a lot of work. Eh, sure. We're going to make a picnic blanket, I guess. Oh, we could probably use this. Uh, change design. Can I change the color palette? Okay, so this is orange, yellow, and white. Here we go. It's going to be a picnic blanket. I liked this one. Plaid outfit. <laughs> We're going to use that to make a picnic blanket. It's very unnatural because of the sharp edges, but for now, I don't really care. So, pickle nick. Okay, can I? Can I? Yeah. Yeah. Pickle nick time. Uh, I really want all those that stuff to come, and the way I'm gonna figure that out is by teleporting a day. Ah, oh, so many, so many. Give me them all. And I want party lights. Give me all these and party lights. All of this and more could be yours for a hell of a lot of Nook Miles tickets. Hell yeah. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I needed the lights. God, I'm a moron. I also need to check in with everybody and see if anyone wants to move out. Because that's become like a, a new daily task that we should keep up with. Okay, please select from the following services. Redeem Nook Miles. Okay, what am I doing again? Party lights. 
Party lights. Party lights. Give them to me. Now. Not now. It'll be tomorrow. But still. Yay. Okay, I gotta wait until tomorrow. Okay, steel trash can and plastic bench. The bench. Uh, I want to put a bench like over here somewhere along this walkway or something. You know what I mean? Maybe by the picnic area. But I want to get like right against a cliff. It's awkward. Or maybe like uh, right where that like tree is could be cool. Let's just stick to our park sector. Man, I don't know. It's looking like it's gonna be like a path and then a bunch of flowers and whatnot. I kinda wanna put it like, a, maybe facing out so you can like gander. You know what I mean? If you're in like a gandering mood, and you can just like gander. Seems like a nice view. Sure. I mean, why not? Let's start placing some paths. Uh, this needs to move. You need to be gone now at this freaking second. Yeah. Okay. And then I want to have like that. That looks lovely. Dude, I'm going to talk to Isabel. And I'm going to be like, what does my island look like? She's going to be like, sorry, I just got finished crying. Sorry, I was too busy crying to rate your island. While I'm at it, here's $1 million. And then everyone's going to clap. That's exactly what's going to happen. Beat for beat. What are your thoughts on racism? Not a huge fan. We check your campsite. Oh, thanks. I completely forgot. I started playing Wobble Dogs lately and it's so silly. Give oh my God. Who are you? Okay, Mary. Hey, it's nice to meet you. I'm Mary. We live on this island, right? I'm camping here. Going to kick back and chill on scunning for a bit. Let's hang out while I'm here. Hell yeah. Bye. I've got paths to make. Oh, what do you have to say? This is like I've been looking for you forever. But anytime I'm on my couch, you're like forever. It's might only been a few minutes. Anyway, I found that thing you were looking for. What? The, um, the python print jacket? Um, what? What do you mean, what? You don't want it? For real? What? Oh, thank you! Wow, thank you, Rex. Hope you like it, even if this is something you're looking for. More wanted. I want it because you gave it to me. What does it look like, Rex? Dude, what do you mean? That looks clean as hell. Thank you, Rex. I look like... I don't look like the wolf of Wall Street. I look like, like the kitten of Wall Street. But still pretty cool. Let's start throwing down some things. Orange. Red. White. White. We're going to be kind of... Oh, I actually got hyacinths instead of windflowers. That's totally fine. It'll look more wild that way. There we go. And then over here, we're going to do orange. Nope. White. White. And we'll do a red one. Just like that. Oh, did I get more things for planting like a metric f, f word ton? <laughs> I almost said a bad word. Whatever. I've, I've, I might start like <laughs> censoring myself less and less as time goes on. Is it for planting a bunch of flowers? Is that what I'm doing? Yeah, flower power. 200 flowers. Oh, that's a big infusion of Nook Miles. That's what I needed, baby. I'm starving. God, it's so hard being me. Am I right? Yum, yum, yum. Dude, wake up. Thank you. Oh my God, your eyes are beautiful, but Jesus. Wow. Blech, it's not a lot of seawater. Yucky. I'm Thomas. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, I'll find your shit. It's totally chill. You don't have to worry about it. I guess I'll look for him. That'll be the last thing I do. Okay. Communicator parse. Communicator parse. Commun Hello? Hello? Thank you. Good lord. Okay. Dude, hell yeah! Woohoo! Okay, I'm gonna put it back in the... Oh. What? It deleted it! Does that mean I just can't do Gulliver's thing? Oh, it's over here now. I don't have the patience for this. Howdy. I haven't played Animal Crossing in over a month, and I feel horrifically guilty. I hope that I don't... I guarantee the second I step in there, they're going to guilt trip me and be like, Whoa, didn't know you were still alive, like your parents do when you sleep in and then come upstairs for the first time. Anyway, there are going to be lots of things to do. Lots of critters to catch. We're very behind. Right now on Scunion, it's 4.03 p.m. on Monday, May 8th. Oh, I swear this CJ is visiting Scunion today. I don't know who that is. Sounds like he's just here to relax, but I know he's not interested in buying fish. Oh, it's Fishman. Oh, I'm so sleepy. Oh, because it's been a while. 
That's really cute. I, I like our little island. It's come a long way. Oh my god! Are you thinking about moving out? Pardon me for not noticing you, Thomas. I've got a lot on my mind right now. Out of curiosity, what would your reaction be if I was to tell you that I'm planning to move away? Vivian! I really like Vivian. Plus, her umbrella is uber cute. Well, shock, nausea, a dead faint. Nothing too dramatic, I hope. For that's exactly what I'm pondering. Has the time come for me to make a change, or should I settle for staying here? What do you think? I really like Vivian, but I told you all the rules. Um, if it's anyone but my favorite, Rex, I'm gonna let them leave. Because I think it'll be fun to have a constantly changing cast of characters. Alright, well, everyone say bye to Vivian. Thank you for all your support during my time here. I leave with a heavy heart. Trust me. But I cannot stagnate in the same pool forever. Ready to leave the water. I'm ready to fly. Best of luck to us both in all our future endeavors. Piffle. Piffle indeed, my friend. But now we get to Vildor Hunt. Yay! <laughs> There's always a silver lining. What up, champ? Oh, Thomas. It's great to see you. How can I help you today? Let's talk evals. I'm so curious about the current image of Scunion. Right now, Scunion... Shit, Isabel! Come on, man. I'm doing my damnedest. I'm growing real nice. Like a big tree that's getting plenty of love and care. I'm trying to copy the secret sauce for success from my artist collective. Well, there you have it. Compared to the last board, more folks running positively. To our scenery. Of course, there's always room for improvement, isn't there? Keep contributing however you can. What do you mean? Okay, I just need more furniture. How do I get my hands on large quantities of furniture? It's all so expensive, and the daily stock is only a few, and uh, it's only a day. Oh. Bye, Isabel. Whee! Let's sell everything we have, and then, um, what else are we going to do before the villager hunt? I guess we can spend some time thinking how we're going to decorate, and we can also catch some fish, any fish we see. Because apparently we need more freaking goddamn furniture. Okay, we snagged it. Boy, howdy. I think I already have that. Cool looking fish, though. Ayo! It's probably one of my little daily deals. Hell yeah, it is. Oh my god. This one has a five times bonus. Sell one thing. <laughs> Sell a hot item for a fortune. Okay. Well, then let's go check the hot item. Uh, what's hot today? Hot items today are a wooden chair. That I can handle. That I can do. That I think I can handle. I'm good for that. Yeah, let's do it. I think I can do that. Now that I think I can handle. I think I can take care of that for you. Got that one locked and loaded. Now that I think I can handle. That's one of those clips that I feel like might be the only reason I would ever make a TikTok just because I want to see if that was placed out there in a vacuum. How people would, what people would say, <laughs> like what they would comment. I just don't have the energy to like clip stuff up, post on TikTok. It's too much extra work. Craft something? Freaking dur. Need a wooden chair. Um, no, stop. Whoa, look at all these new things. Box shape seat. A matryoshka. A ukulele. Lattice fence is really cute. Um, I like that a lot. That could be fun. The egg outfit is stupid and dumb, and why is it even here? Wooden chair. All right. Loving these chill vibes. I'm so glad. I'm a chill vibe merchant. Come here. Don't you want to be a part of my chill vibes, dude? Get in here. Get in my pockets. Oh, a sea creature. There are tons of new ones of those, too. I should snag that RQ. Oh, it's a sea urchin. I wasn't even urchin for it. <laughs> uh, sea urchin. Check. Let's see. What are... We need a gigas giant clam. <laughs> oh, it's worth 15,000. That means it's going to be rare as frick. A lobster, a sea pineapple, a state pencil urchin, slate pencil urchin, a spotted garden eel, and a vampire squid. Epic. Okay. Uh, let's... What was I doing? Oh, yeah, let's sell the chair. And then I guess we can maybe search for some critters. Well, maybe we should prioritize um, getting on this villager hunt because it could take a while or it could take very little if we immediately find someone we like. So maybe we do that first and then use the rest of the stream to just do all the little tasks like... Looking for critters. I want to offer you a chair. Also this fish. There you go. The chair's hot today. Boom. It's like nothing. All right. I just realized this has just completed a run. And loving these chill vibes is cool down. What run did you complete, Emily? And in what game? I'm a freaking moron. I'm sure you meant a real run. That was the most humiliating chronically online thing I've ever said in my entire life. Or maybe you did mean a speedrun. I, now I'm really hoping it was a speedrun because if not, that is brutal. God damn it. I am today's youth. Oh, shit. It was a real run. God damn it. Don't wrap things up. I almost made a baby quit Animal Crossing. Okay. 
So I think I need to skip forward two days, right? Because tomorrow she'll be in boxes and then the day after she'll be gone. Unless anyone wants Vivian. And we can, eh, no, that'll take like an hour. <laughs> I think I have to skip two days, right? Am I, am I wrong? I hope I don't skip two days and screw this up. I'm gonna wrap things up and I'm gonna skip two days. System, date and time. Uh. Oh, it's still a day forward. It thinks it's May 8th. I didn't even notice. Well, that's awkward. Okay, let's skip forward two days. Oh my God, tomorrow's my birthday now. <laughs> on my switch all right and now we should have a vacant plot who's your favorite vill villager on your island rex he's so sweet we're such good friends hello everyone right now it's scunny it's, it's a wednesday sure is tomorrow it's gonna be able to f tomorrow why tomorrow i thought i skipped two days what the hell are you talking about tomorrow let's see let's check in on vivian's home and see if it's just a plot or if for some reason she's still there because the like morning announcement made it seem like she's still there she is. You're supposed to be gone, Vivian. What the hell, Vivian? You're not supposed to be here. Well, yeah, that's right. I'll miss you, Vivian, but you should have already been gone. <laughs> we'll skip another day, I guess. No. It's my birthday now. <laughs> oh, no. It's gonna, is it gonna pretend it's my birthday and, like, celebrate? I'm gonna feel so bad if they all say happy birthday to me and it's not actually my birthday. Oh, I'm gonna feel terrible. If you go back in time, she should be gone. I take your word for it. Or she might still be there, but you could skip a day without it being your birthday. That would be rad. Thank you. All right. Okay. There's the plot. And is it still empty? Boy, howdy, is it? All right. Let's grab our tickets and let's get hunting, ladies and germs. Ladies and therms. Fingers crossed for Punchy or just anyone else that tickles my fancy. Move to pockets. Move to pockets. What up, mister? It's been a while, but I'm gonna be talking to you like a million times today, so. Mayday ticket, what the hell? I got a mayday ticket here from Tom Nook with Thomas written on it, which makes it yours. It's only good for a limited time, so when you wanna use it, say I wanna fly. What is a mayday ticket? Mayday tour. I'll do the mayday thing later. All right, as a refresher, I will be searching until I find either Punchy or just someone who I make an instant connection with. You're really cute. You're cute. Hi, Jacques. Sicking the vibes. Oh, ah, oh, you're cute. You're really cute. Goodbye. Not, not quite enough connection. Almost, almost. Cause I do really love that little fella. That's a, that is a close call right there for certain. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. Another birdie. Very cute. But your eyes, I don't like that they're like. They have shadows. You look very tired, <laughs> and it makes me tired by extension. Ladder. No thanks. A hippopotamus! I can't see you walking out further. I wanna see your eyes. Oh, it's angry! I like you. <laughs> Biff, you're for survival. Oh, you're a jock? Okay, never mind. And you called me squirt. That's mean. Oh, it's another little birdie. Hi. Robin, I confess, I thought I might never run into anyone else here. I'm starting to feel like a castaway on a deserted island. la di da And there you were. What a relief. You seem very sweet. But I'm, I'm being very discerning here. No. <laughs> Come on, please, we're running out of time! I know, I know it's unrealistic to look for only Punchy, but, like, there are plenty of cool fellas out there that I'm, I might make a connection with. I made a connection with that hippo. Hornsby. So come on. We're running out of time. But I, I can't. Punchy! Oh my god. Oh, you're terrifying. I, for some reason, for a second, I thought it was Punchy. What's your name? Lucky. Oh my god, it's like a mummified pup. Oh, there's someone on this island. Oh, you're here visiting too? Hey, I'm Lucky. I'm Thomas from Scunion. Neat. You expect to make a friend here. That is so cool. Ouch. You've been gravely injured. Goodbye, Lucky. Next. Oh wait, maybe I can maybe I can sneak a peek. No. Wait. It's you again! I, is this the is this the hairy guy that I met previously that y'all kept shitting on and I said, no, come on, he's cute. It is Harry! <laughs> I kinda like Harry. Don't believe we met. Name's Harry. Fancy beat you here, uh. 
Whoever here is. I might fuzzy on that part, beach bum. You're funny! Do I pull the trigger on Harry? What is on his face? It's a beard, dude. Freaking y'all are so judgmental about Harry. How come every time I find Harry, y'all are shitting on the poor fella? You know what, Harry? I've got a plot on my island that I think has your name on it, Harry. Ugh, oh, wanna come to my island, Harry? That's quite an invite. Y'all can suck it, all you Harry haters. All right, we found our friend. I like Harry. That's, I'm glad. I am pleased with the outcome of that. We didn't find Punchy, but we still have even more tickets to spare for the future. Harry is incoming. This is brilliant news. Okay, and we're finally back home. Animal Crossing. Going back to Skanyan. Let me tell you, we've been pretty inconsistent with our visits to Skanyan. Uh, we basically didn't play it. We played maybe one time in April. So now that it's like mid to late May, we have a large, large backlog of critters that we need to catch to the tune of about 15 or 16 fish, about 10 bugs, and about six, I think, sea creatures. There are three bugs that'll be on tree stumps, so maybe we go to an island, chop down all the trees, and hunt for some tree stump, tree stump fellows. I'd like that to be today's focus. We've been doing a lot of villager searching, but now that, now that I'm sure we won't have anyone wanting to move out because we just played last week, critters are gonna be the name of the game. I have an event announcement. Oh, there's an event going on. In honor of internet, I also miss my birthday. <laughs> I didn't go to Scandi on my birthday. In honor of International Museum Day, the museum is hosting a stamp rally through the end of the month. What does that even mean? There are prizes. Okay, well, you piqued my interest, but what is the stamp rally? Okay, so you're on. Uh, what is the stamp Well, back. We back. My little mailbox is so rinky-dinky. I love it. Happy Home Academy. Rank A? Yeah, it's no big deal. All right, the inside of our house is pretty lame. We just don't have a lot of furniture. Happy birthday for mummy! Today, you're one year older and one year wiser. Maybe it's time to give broccoli another go. No matter what, you always be my baby. Aw, oh, thanks, Mom. Thanks, fictional scunion Mom. Mommy has given me a cake. I'm not gonna eat it. Let's talk to Hornsby. Can you see me? What is happening? I'm, like, terrified that maybe I was a ghost for the last month. Oh, I'm sorry. We should talk to all our friends, because we haven't talked to them in a while, and I feel terrible. Well now, Thomas, it's been a while since we had us a chinwag. You've been avoiding me? Thought maybe it was something I'd done. I don't know if I'm my bath near about well, not last we spoke. Well, don't you worry. I'm on the straight and narrow now. I'm squeaky clean, even behind the ears. Gotta clear that up for you. See you around. See you around. I love you, Dobie. You're funny. You, I forgot, were here. <laughs> Let's be honest. I'm just gonna come out and ask. You've been avoiding me? Oh, God. Is every individual person gonna freaking say this? I've been talking two months. Just in case I did something to bug you. I'm really, really sorry. Guess you're talking to me now. So maybe I should cut this out before I really do annoy you. It's all right. We're making amends with everybody. I love my bridge right here. This is a quite nice bridge. I do enjoy it heavily. Let's check the map at the, at the bottom. So we have that bridge. I did say that I eventually wanted a bridge. And I wasn't lying when I said it. I did say I eventually wanted a bridge like here-ish between like the museum and the, and the neighborhood. Like maybe up here at a diagonal. See, I might I might want a bridge right there. So let's let's get started on that. Because I deserve it. And also I have I have this fat stacks. Okay, let's uh sell a bunch of crap. I'm out of space. Oh, oh, that's new. Where did it go? There you are. It's really fast. Hello? I see you. Nice. That thing is massive. A darner dragonfly. Freaking check it off. Stamp rally. Give a brief explanation. International Museum Days. As a collecting place for all types of knowledge, museums are critical resource, are a critical resource for learners far and wide. Indeed, they can spark imaginations, make difficult ideas easier, and perhaps even more fun to grasp. But to put it simply, International Museum Day is a day for getting to know your local museum. Now, the stamp rally works thusly. The bug, fish, fossil, and art galleries each have three stamp stations. You must find the stations in each gallery and acquire their stamps. Do so and you earn a memento. There are several unique mementos, one for completing the rally in each gallery. Ooh, it's true. Do be sure to give it a go whilst perusing the museum's many fine exhibits. I will do that. Let's do the stamp rally. F it. There's too much to do, man. I do want to be out and about, so if, I, if any bugs, bugs spawn, then whatever. I need to find a stamp station. I need to find three stamp stations. Boom! The pond. I think these guys are little aquatic athletes. Go team! Oh, this is precious. This is so cute. I want to do a stamp rally at my local museum. Oh, I see. I see you. Look at all my fishies. The deep. That is one big ocean. Now I need the coral reef. Coral reef! Give me my stampies. I got all the fish stamps! That's good for one memento, allegedly. 
Okay, I need buggy. Oops, I just straight up smooched that drywall. Harry! Well, hey there, you. This is where you've been living all this time. So you your invite back to the other island. Move myself here to this one, beach bum. Great to meet you here again. I hope to be seeing a lot of you now. Oh, I hope too. I like you, Harry. I think you're really cool. Everyone in chat is very mean to you for some reason. I think you're awesome. You seem like you have lots of love to give. I see that stamp station. Sometimes it's nice to take a short breather and relax on the bench. The quiet bench. Oh, man, this game knows what's up, dude. In the world of, of sensory overload gaming experiences, I like that Animal Crossing is just like, dude, just stick your ass cheeks on a bench. Watch the bugs flutter by. Butterfly garden. Sitting on a bench at this fountain, about as classy as it gets. Unless you're viscerally afraid of butterflies, like that one person in my chat said last time I came to Butterfly Garden. That's probably not super classy. Probably would actually rock your world. Hyacinths with a little snail on it. That's not a butterfly. I found an imposter. You're not a butterfly. That's mean. I'm sorry. I basically just... I'm sorry. I, I just hate crimed in a butterfly garden. I'm sorry. I need to find the shady path. There we go. Shady path. Ah, oh, that moth is sick. Seems like the temp temperate climate bugs are relaxing here. I'm amazing. I collected all the bug stamps. Now I just need the... Okay, bagworm. That's a wasp. This is the thing I... Like, I love that they have all the bugs on the loose or whatever, and you can just look at them or whatever. Why would wasps be one of them? One of the bugs you just leave out in the open, like an inch from people's big dumb faces. I never want to be... I don't want a wasp to have easy access to me. Okay, well, stamp station. Not really much to comment on. Looks like they're still planning the exhibit that'll go here. That's my fault. That's on me. There we go. I did get one of the most important ones, though. I think we got one other one. Like, one more. One more painting. Looks like they're still planning the exhibit that'll go here. Stamp rally! Look at how beautiful this unfinished room is. This is like a bummer, dude. I need to get on it with the sculpture. I should make a habit of every time I play checking that back. Oh, there we go. There's one. Art from the East. Art from Asia always has such a unique and compelling beauty. I agree. I collected all the art stamps. There it is. <laughs> That's all. Okay. I should make a habit of checking for uh, that scam artist dude in the back of my island every day because I have two. Okay. Fossiles. Fossiles, I think we're actually closing in. I think we're getting close with the fossils. There's two right here. Oh my god. Mollusks and arthropods. No backbone, but still tough, I bet. Why are we bringing gambling into this? Vertebrates. Now, these guys have some backbone. It's a big orb on the ceiling. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> it's funny. That's all the stamps. Oh, dear. Pardon me. That's that stamps I see. Oh, it's several, in fact. I'm going to mark your hard work with an aptly named completion stamp. Let's see. Bing bong. Here's the memento I promised you. Furniture. It's a fish plaque. Not for the bugs. For daring to enter their fearsome presence. I dare you. I give you another... Whatever the hell. Without any further ado, here's the memento I promised you. Is it a bug plaque? It's a bug plaque. For the fossils. For uncovering their ancient mysteries, I grant you whatever the hell. Do I get a fossil plaque? Oh my god. I did it! Oh my god. Behold, every day? You can do that every day to get a bunch of furniture items? Dude, totally. Okay, I'm gonna need to play this in, like, in my, on my own time then to get all this furniture. Because I've been looking for furniture around one of those. So there's less ground to cover. What up, Pally? Long time no see. How long has it been? One month? What do you mean you've been around? That's weird. I understand. You've been playing while I've been sleeping. Good, just woke me up. You are so charming, my friend. Good lord. Okay, th thumb nook. Hey, Pally. Uh, hello? There you go. I couldn't remember how to get on the thing. Hey, pal. This is a construction consultation counter. How can I help you? Let's talk infrastructure. Uh, bridges and inclines, please. How can I help you? Let's build a bridge. Bridges are a good way to collect connect land separated by rivers. Yeah, I figured. Dude, the, bri the brick ones are precious. Prunches. Let's do another brick one. The brick ones are prunches. I would like a brick bridge. 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 I wanted to go right here. No. Maybe I go from the other side because it has a cleaner thing. I want it to be a diagonal because it's prettier that way. Right here. No, no, shoot. Well, this is like exactly where I wanted this bridge to go. Could also put it right there, I suppose, but man, 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 man. I also should probably demolish this bridge and build a new nicer one because that's lame as hell. Yeah, because then I could like blah, 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 and then it would go straight up. I don't want to buy like a 
terraforming permit. It's so expensive. Farts. Well, I'll just put it here. No, I I want my island to be perfect. Oh, I can't afford it. Shit. I need 500 more miles. Okay. F word. I said I didn't, uh, but I, I don't want to go back on my word. Ugh. I said I wasn't going to do any terraforming because I thought it was lame to basically just build the kind of island that you want. And I wanted to build around the natural island shape because it would be more fun. But yeah, I said I wouldn't. I don't want to back out on that. I guess I'll do it. But I'm stuck. But I'm sticking to my guns that I'm not doing any major terraforming projects. So I think that's lame as hell to basically just a Lego set style build the whole island from scratch. Isabel, meet me face to face. Stop hiding behind your desk, you bureaucratic scum. Let's talk island evals. Just curious about the current image of Scunion. Isabel, how long are you going to play these games? That's all I'm wondering. How long are you going to just drag me along on your stupid doggy leash okay well is there any nice furniture i can craft maybe i'll show you furniture asshole the garden furniture is, uh, is great maybe i make some more like garden type furniture some more barrels and buckets get real rustic with it you need like a table and chair uh we got a couple chairs natural garden table there we go this is for you and then chair chair and now we're gonna push that over to there. There you go. And I'll put another one like on this backside. And now you have a place to uh consume. I feel like it needs a little more. Maybe it probably needs like a little dirt path under it that I'm not too lazy to put down, so I'm just gonna keep it there. Oh, really? I forgot this happens. Can I not? Oh my god. Can I not like hey. that is stupid! Why can't you put something in the middle? Don't move the whole table. Oh, well shit. There you go. Take it for a spin. Isabel, lay it on me. Let me hear it. Let's talk island evals. I am doing everything in my power, Isabel, to bring more furniture to Scunion. Maybe you should stop asking me what I could do to improve and asking yourself what you could be doing to improve. I eat some cheese. You are such a freaking singer, aren't you, Sky? Sorry, I'm just lashing out now. Okay, let's put away all my things that I don't need and make a bug expedition. Okay, we're gonna use these tickets and we are going to, well, just one of them. We're gonna go to an island, pray it's not raining. We only have 25 minutes left. We're gonna cut down every tree, every single tree, leave all the stumps, and I'm just gonna run around and look for things flying around or sitting on stumps. There should be like nine bugs in play here that are new. Axe. Let's start cutting down trees and it's not raining. Beep, Bop. tree, tree, tree. This is good because we're also low on wood. All right, I think we've cut down all the trees. Let's make sure we have all the flowers picked and then we just run around. Anything that spawns that we don't like, I guess we just catch it. There's a ladybug. It'll be dead within the hour. Okay, bugs that are out there that we can grab are the Agrias butterfly would just be flying around. The banded, the banded dragonfly would just be flying around. The great purple emperor can just be flying around. The Madagascan sunset moth can just be flying around. And then the jewel beetle, Rosalia, Batessi beetle, and the violin beetle can all be found on tree stumps. Those are all available right now and until four. Some of them until five, but I don't know if, I hope the banded dragonfly and the darner dragonfly don't look similar because that would be obnoxious. I'm just gonna catch all of the dragonflies in case they are different. That, yep, okay. They were very similar. I did it! Did you see that? I got a banded dragonfly. I don't know why I said I did it all excited because you've done that a million times, uh, but I'm still happy that you're pumped up about it. There we go. Here's one. Boom! What's that? Rosalia Batessi Beetle. I don't know how to pronounce that, so I guess. Easier to do than say. Wow, that's actually exactly my concern. We did get one new bug while here. I will say, it wasn't a complete waste. <gasps> Need to be so careful. So gentle, so slow. Boom! Boom! Jewel beetle. Okay, now let's hang in there and try to get that last one. There's one more stump bug. The violin beetle. Let's see if we can hang in there and find that one before we leave. Or until our net breaks. One of the two. Thanks. You were sucking up the freaking pool. The spawn pool. 
and I don't want you to. Okay, we're done. Ready to go home, and now we're gonna hunt for sea critters. We're we're gonna go switching for Creech, and there's one now. New thing? Nah, you're mine. Whoa! A spotted garden eel. Check it off. Was it unspotted before I saw it? That's funny. That was that was good. Probably like more seaweed or an anemone or something. Uh, I don't want it. I don't want it. I was hoping I'd find more new things. Has not been happening. Finding a lot of seaweed and anemones and sea slugs. Well, yeah, they're great. They're cute little babies, but I want a new thing. You're like a little quick, like in an interesting way. The pearl oysters keep tricking me into thinking it's something cool. And it's always just a pearl oyster. Yahoo! Seaweed. Hello, sweetums. Hornsby. The the big the big kahuna though, um, no pun intended, is the fish. The fish as a whole. We have like six I think sixteen fish? Fifteen fish. There are fifteen fish we need to catch. And as I've expressed many times, fishing while on stream, almost impossible for me because of my capture cards delay. Oh there everyone. Man on Scunny, it's two oh two PM on Sunday, May twenty eighth. That it is. Bye, Isabel. Bring nothing to the table. We need to put more furniture down in our in our everlasting journey. Let's check what they have at the clothing store. Everlasting journey to get to five stars on our island. Okay, let's uh let's go buy the waterscaping permit. Cause I think we forgot. Oh, there's Phil. Seems to have a different dude. It's been one week. You guys are like Velcro pets. Only get one body, don't wreck it. Dog. Don't tell me how to live my life. I think we forgot to do the waterscaping. Let's get a waterscaping permit so we can... Uh, I'm not going to do any major terraforming because I'm having a lot more fun just working with the island the way it is. Uh, but I'd like to make the river a little wider so I can build a bridge because a place where I want a bridge is not available for whatever reason. Okay. It's like 6,000, right? Yeah, waterscaping. There we go. Oh, it's expensive. Sure. I'll hesitantly do it. Waymer. It's been updated. Wahoo! I can do river construction with whatever the hell. Thanks, guys, for the collapse. Uh, this right here is where I want the bridge, and I think it needs to be a little wider. Uh, so let's let's get out our our waterscaping. That's the wrong button. Let's get out our waterscaping. Press plus. Yeah, I'm aware. Let's start it up. Wow. Okay, this is getting on my nerves. Why? Why? This is so challenging. Put that back. <sighs> It's impossible to tell like where I'm aiming. Okay, I feel like this is it. I think this is the one. We're gonna give it a try. I think I still have the bridge kit like that. That's it, that's the ticket. Let me imagine it. Wow, that's perfect. That is perfect. All right. Now we have somewhere to throw all our money. I wanna give you everything I have. We have zero bells. So close. I'll help. And we got it's everything I have, but it's not everything I have because I've also got some more in the bell dispenser or whatever. A, B, D. I think I need like 40 or 50K for the bridge, but I'd like to have some on, on hand. Take my money, dude. Get everything. All of it. That's it? Okay. I guess I have to wait until tomorrow. Farts. Okay. There's a tiny fish up there that I want. We're going to check out the A, B, D furniture. What are you doing over there? Are you thinking or are you just inspecting? Check this out. It's like a fun way, an amateur, like you, to, oh, build some muscle. Treasure hunt. You should play a treasure hunt game with me. Sure. Digging holes for treasure. You're going to train. Okay. What even is this? Oh, he's hiding treasure. He can distract it, but I don't much care. I buried some treasure. Find it within the time limit. You win. Buried it somewhere outside. I love playing treasure hunt with you, bud. Okay, let's inspect every open tile of land. We only have a few minutes, so a little stressful. I doubt they'd make the treasure hunt very difficult. I guess it's probably just luck, like hoping that doesn't spawn in some like really inaccessible spot. Okay, Bud is like a wilderness trainer, so he probably like put this on a cliff to look cool. Come on. Oh? Is that treasure or a fossil? Shit. Boom! I found treasure. I'm gonna report back to Bud. Oh, I, I missed that music. It was great. Hey, Bud. I found your treasure. I did it. That was quick. New music for you. I can muscle it open for you. Hand it here. Let's see what you found. I hope it's furniture. A 
Thanks, bud. The do rag. What does that look like? Pretty cute, but I like my hair. I, I want my hair to be visible because I like it. That is very sweet, though. Thank you. Oh my god, get it! I hate to say it, bud, but I think you're hopelessly outmatched on that one. Okay, let's check out the ABD furniture. So I can- any furniture I've gotten before, I can buy more of. Not that. I'm good on the bidet and the board game. Book. Bottled ship. I could get more bunny day topiaries. Hmm. The cooler is really cute. The floating planner is awesome. Let's buy- let's buy that. Garden lantern, I like a lot. No. Ah, oh, what?! Oh, and now I see the hand car, which I really like. That's dumb. It's a freaking way today. Okay, well, we'll pick up where we left off, which is like Garden Lantern. Everything below Garden Lantern, we'll check out tomorrow. Whatever. Hornsby, you seem like a ring toss guy. You seem like someone who'd partake in some like lawn games. Okay, uh, a couple tiki torches is, is the last one. And these I had in mind uh, to put them by the campsite. Why is there no, oh, because I think Bud's in the way. That's all right. I'll, I'll, I'll wait for you to mosey on out here. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do with all our, our, uh, freaking whatever. What the hell am I trying to say? Fences. Let's put it along here. I like that. Let's do, um, along the path, and then I'll put some, like, flowers and trees back there. Or, better yet, this can be where we have our little outside aquarium because it's right by the museum. I love it! Okay, well, let's go ahead and build a fence while we're at it. it can be, like, here is, like, the entrance, and then there's all these fish that are out and about. There we go. I like that. I don't know if I like the, um, I don't. I don't like the fences. I don't like the fences along this path. I'd rather it be like hedges or bushes if we ever get access to those again. So I'm gonna hold off and I'm gonna wait until we can do bushes for this part. But I like the fences along the street. So like the horizontal ones we keep. How did I do the fences over here? I just did them. Did I have like a bush? Yeah, I was about to say, I like this, like, bush then fence. Um, I need a bunch more bushes, because I also want some along those fences. So maybe I push these back one, and then there's room for some bushes along here eventually. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, and then this will be, like, aquarium zone. You know, like, the zone for, for the, for aquarium. Very nice. And then this will be where I put all my fish. My various fish. Where else could we use some... This, like, area is missing something. Maybe we put a second... No, because there's one right there. This, like, zone needs some love. This whole area. And I just don't really know what to do with this, like, big slice. Uh, maybe flowers. Maybe we just throw some frick... Also, this is awkward. This, like, weird gap. There's a lot of just, like, awkward, empty space. Because I kind of want this, like, little industrial zone to be... Like, I like how this one's, like, kind of squared off. But over here, it's just, like massive empty i guess we'll just let's make a you know what whenever i don't know what to do and sit in and put a bunch of flowers in there because whatever okay. awesome work okay we're out of fences uh i was thinking and then i would put like a ring of dirt path that's like around this so it makes like a weird little thing you can nice running dude like a weird little thing you can walk around and i'll put a dirt path under this and then put it back eventually and i'll probably break this rock i guess so it can be literally anywhere else dark dirt path I'm gonna make a ring around our flower thing so it's like a nice little path you can walk along and whatever wow check check it out and then i'll put the tree back like right around here because i do want to have another tree by the campsite uh i'm gonna have this stone path just keep going and then i guess it'll like turn upward yeah turn up all right <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. And then I'll have flowers on all the non dirt spaces and I'll put some some dirt paths down for a cute little accent kind of deal. We're gonna like scatter some red, some white. Some white one. A couple white ones. There we go. Do one more white one there. And then a couple of red. Five red, five white. In the rose section. Right here. This needs to be something. Like a clock. A park clock. Perfect. We'll put a park clock right there. Uh, let's go ahead and order that before I forget. Park clock. Yeah. It, it flies. All right. Park clock will come tomorrow. Let's start throwing. Let's just throw down all our fish in the like general area that our outdoor aquarium is gonna be in eventually let's start piling them up like 
Put one here. Uh, let's, let's, let's line them up back here first. Blaze so. item. Um, carp. Maybe next to this fossil, we can throw it down. Dippy. Oh, it's like a littler square tank. I like it there. Um, this actually is turning out pretty cute so far. It's literally not visible, so let's put it like here. And then let's do some dirt path work here. You know what I might do? This is like a big section of like dirt path. So I might um do what some places do and leave like the center column. Like, you know what I mean? Like put a tree there or something or like some flowers or like some sign like right here and you like go around it and then it kind of like breaks into open path. You know what I mean? So I might put like a sign there or a tree there or something. This actually looks a lot nicer than I thought it would. I'm enjoying this. Do placing all these tanks count as placing furniture? Cause if so, that is a lot of very accessible furniture. Whoa, cool butterfly back there. This is good. All right, we've done some path work there. Go ahead and make the path to where our bridge is gonna be. Okay, now how wide do I want it to be? I guess three. Eh, need to be three. I think it does. I like the like unnatural shape before someone's like, it's not symmetrical. It's like, yeah, it's the plan. I'm really pleased with, with where our island is at the, at the end of, of our decoration phase so far this stream. So I would like to now have a nice chat with Isabel. Let's, uh, let's, let's give me four stars, I swear to God. All right, folks, deep breath. Into the nose, out through the mouth. I swear to God, if you say the same shit about you my furniture, I've been throwing furniture everywhere. I'm going to shoot you, Isabel. I'm going to shoot you specifically and exclusively you. I'm going to shoot you. There's so much space we're gonna have to figure out. That's gonna be a later problem. We did it. We did a good job here today. We, wait, no, no, no. I still have two log benches. I need to figure out what to do with. Well, they can go here. Log bench. Log bench. And then we need a table. There's a little picnic zone for having picnics, among other things. Up. All right, out and about. Ready to find something awesome, probably. I'm sure it'll be super good and not just a bunch of lame ass shit again. Scalp. Yay, my friend. Hey, man. Put the scalp here. Is gonna have it? Yeah, here you go. Whoa, thanks for your generosity, man. Bye. Since you were cool, I left you something you'll dig. Let me lay some truth on you. The deep kind. Feel this. The tide covers a lot of ground, man. But you never see it in a hurry. Stick that in your skill and let it simmer. Yep, today's a good day. Bye. Whoa! It's a slate pencil urchin. Its handwriting is gorgeous. Take your word for it. Okay, well then let's check it off. It's you, right? It's this one that was the really quick one. Yes, please. It's a lobster! Check it off. Lobster. All right, now I just need the giant clam and a vampire squid. Oh my God, I completely lost track of time. It's almost five. Wow, we did not find clam. <laughs> Or the vampire strip, but that's fine. A lot of people in the chat were talking about how long it took them to find the clam, so it looks like that one's gonna be an absolute freaking tragedy. So, did not expect to find the clam so easily. All right, well, I guess I guess I'm gonna go sell my wares and then call it a stream. We worked our asses off just to stay at the same number of stars, which sucks dick, but that's okay. This is stream number 15 of Animal Crossing. How crazy is that? This was playing Animal Crossing in the first place was just such a spur of the moment decision because I was feeling sick and had to miss like a Super Bowl party at school because I was sick and I was bummed about it. I was like, I want to stream to feel better. And I didn't know what to play. My friend was like, well, I mean, Animal Crossing is kind of fun when, when you're sick. And I was like, I haven't played much Animal Crossing. Uh, so I just like thought it would be a one-off stream of just kind of dawdling around. Uh, welcome to stream number 15 of Animal Crossing. 
Let's game. It's rainy today. We haven't played in a while. Like, I, as usual, I haven't played since last week. I, I sh really should because I'm, I'm way behind on all my, like, fish catching and stuff like that. But I just haven't been feeling super well. So when I'm not, like, getting work done, I'm usually just, like, lying down. I really should play some off screen because I can't really fish on stream. Hi, Isabel. It's 2.02 p.m. on Sunday. I don't have any big news to share. You never do, man. I taking a walk on the beach this morning and spotted these rare colored shells called summer shells. Only wash during the summertime. I wonder if I, I... I'm sure you can get... Oh. I was about to say, I'm sure there are some really cute summer-themed crafting recipes. Shell wreath? I mean, sure. Fun day? Oh, I will. Phone's ringing. Hello? Oh, hey, it's Harvey. I'm calling f I forgot you existed. I'm sorry. I might kind of need kind of a favor. Got some real sweet folks here who want some special photos made. Huh. Ramble your way to Photopia and help a shutter dog out? Maybe I should. I literally never visited Harvey. I forgot to. I feel kind of bad. Um, so let's see here. What kind of path would be fitting for this area? Well, I'm thinking like dirt path to here, and then here it picks up with something like fancy. Oh, terracotta is perfect. Oh. Oh. Damn, man. They are really, like, discerning with where you put... Really? That's not even the fair? At least it can go there. Is it because of the bunny or is it because of the bridge? If it's because of the bunny, we can move the bunny. How about now? I feel like it's because of the bunny because it, it let me do it over here. Mm. Maybe this tile is now a fair game. Yes, but this one isn't? Never mind, it was just a weird hitbox. This looks great so far. I really like these paths. Can I? Flawless. Okay. Thank God they let you do that. Beep, up, up. Scoopy, boop. Scoop. Oh, yeah. This uh, table's going to have to get moved. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll move it two little drags. Okay, dude. Now is not the time for rest. We haven't played in a week, okay? You had plenty of time to rest. Oh, too early. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Here we go. Here we go. Hooray! Look at this lovely estate. Do paths count as decorating? They should. I'm sure they don't. I'm sure they don't count that. It's like decoration points because you can make infinite of them without resources. But like, come on, man. Okay, now where do I want this path to go? Maybe like betwixt the trees because we have this like awkward, huge area here. Let's get rid of some trees here. Boom. Boom. I don't know what to do with this, like, big area over here. You know what? Let me let me go ahead and first finish off the pathing over here. There we go. One gnar. One gnar. And then we'll coive this last corner bit. Okay. Okay. Oh, my whole computer just froze for a little bit. I'm sure the stream did as well. Okay. Um, there we go. Okay, up there was the little area we slowly started working on last time with campfires and whatnot. And then I think we were going to today maybe consider moving our campsite and putting a staircase here uh, because we need one. So let's maybe go ahead and... Uh, no, we still have our path stuff out. We should figure out paths. Okay, I'm thinking like... Maybe it goes back around here and then like loops up here and in here is this thing and like some other stuff over here. Maybe some fencing. But the thing is, none of that counts as furniture, so Isabel's not going to give a shit. And be like, I planted you a pretty garden. She's going to be like, yeah, all right, fart face. I don't see any tables. F. Hate her. She seems nice. <laughs> but I hate her. Yeah, I kind of want to just leave all the trees where they are. So it looks more natural. Because if I mess with it, I'm always going to know in the back of my head that it's not how the land naturally was. It's not how twer you, you feel. Let's do that. And then I think... I think... Why are you turning like that, you freak? The thing is, there are only so many, like, themes for little decorative things we can do with the crafting recipes you start with. Because I don't really have many other furniture items. And, like, there's only so many, much we can do. It's pretty much just, like... Let's make a 12th park and an 18th picnic zone. It's like, man, I need something new. Ugh, I hate this so much. This little triangle thing. How did no one, like, making the game be like, oh, this is really obnoxious. We should make that, like, a, a, a possibility. Like, it just looks stupid. 
Can we make it look less stupid? And they would have been like, yeah, that'll take like an afternoon to code. Uh, this looks stupid. This weird shape, but I don't really have much of a choice, do I? Okay, so I'll do some weird little fence work here. I'll just make like a ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba fences and put some like flowers over here or some shit. Sure. You know what? what? Damn it! I tried to put it away and hit the wrong button. All right, squad gang. Let's see if we can move the campsite because I don't want it here anymore. Where it is. I don't want it there. I do not like it. No, 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 I say. That is what I say. Tom, hit me with the goods. Now, drop your cup of joe and drop to the flow. Uh... <laughs> what do I hit? Let's talk relocation. What building do you want to move? The campsite, please. I would have been really sad if I was looking through the list of movable buildings and campsite wasn't on there. 10,000 bells to move it. Yeah, man. Works for me. Thank you for your business. Next step will be to pick out the campsite's new location. Yeah, sir. Oh, shoot. I didn't actually think this through. Where are we going to put the campsite? I definitely want to put it on a cliff area. Definitely, definitely, definitely want to put it in the cliff area. Because I think it's, it would be cute to have a campsite up in the cliffs. But the question is, what cliff area? Where do I want this campsite? Up there could be cute. Let's do that. On the like very top of the cliff next to this little pond. I think that's really cute. There's a tree in the way. And my axe and my shovel are both broken. Awesome. Oh wait, no, 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 I forgot. It just deletes trees if you, if you, if there's a tree in spot. I forgot. Okay. Uh, let me imagine it. Yeah, that's a great spot. Boom. It's a new location for the campsite. We get even more visitors now. Yeah, it's actually as inconvenient as physically possible. I guess we should probably visit Harv's Island because I keep forgetting to do that. Poor guy. My inventory is clear enough. Let's just do that. Scusa. In we go. Remember how abandoned this place was when we first landed? And now it's a bustling, hustling, grustling metropolis. Take me away. I want to fly. Uh, I'll visit Harvest Island for the first time literally ever. Literally ever. Uh, hi, everyone. I finally made it. Your island's like way cuter than mine, Harv. Yeah, I hear you. We're still groovy and whatever anniversary shoot. Just behind a little. Mm, well, okay, but what do we do about the lovely sets? Probably them ourselves could get a bit ticklish. What up? Yeah, what grunt work do you need to do? Oh, my main squeeze, Cyrus. What up, main squeeze? This song's really cute. You want to get some anniversary photos made? Fancy ones with sets and stuff. Because it's June now, and June is wedding season. Uh, here they are. Thing is, I'm cool with lending out my studio, but wedding sets are running slightly behind schedule. I'd ordered decorations and painted the walls and floor, but then a neat bird flew by, and there went May. Long story, uh, long. Someone still gotta move stuff around so it looks wedding-y and snap some photos. So, think I could ask you to be that someone? Sure, whatever. Sounds fun. Let's go. Okay, dog. Still, I was watching the Red Sox game, so I wasn't paying full attention and a little unclear what my job is, but... This is my wedding picture studio. It's, uh, actually my kitchen with some set walls put up. I don't know if you get hungry. This is your first time out of my studios, whatever the hell. You press done, uh, change the decor in a studio, just like you do at home. You have set decorations, I got a special deal going on with Nook Shopping. So if it's in your catalog, you can just borrow one on the spot that you use in your set. Sweet like granola, right? What? What am I what am I getting out of this? Hi. It's my hubby, my darling. The name's Cyrus. Good to meet ya. Hi, pals. What is going on? You get crafting recipes. Oh, that's worth it. Oh, that's 100% worth it. I gotta just decorate wedding. Sigh guy. Build some custom wedding furniture. Isn't that so sweet of my schmoopy? Make it look like a chapel. Plenty of pink and white. Sound good, ma'am. Okay. Uh, plenty of pink and white. We've got wedding bench, wedding decoration. We got the walls and the rug. Yeah, man. Throw them down. Some decorations. I think it looks great. <laughs> okay. We'll make them hang from the ceiling, and it'll look really romantic, and you'll, like, kiss each other or whatever. Okay, and then this will go, like... I don't know, man. I guess just in this corner could look fine. No, that's, that's terrible. Horrific, even. Okay. 
We've got our flowers. Yahur. Geese naw. Okay. You guys look great or whatever. Okay, and then this looks like whatever. Why do you have to pretend you're in a wedding chapel? You posers. Maybe it's concern for COVID. I don't know. I wonder if during COVID anyone had a wedding over Zoom. I'm sure that happened. That's brutal. <laughs> okay. Um, what other goodies do we have? This looks great already. They want a lot of pink and white. Pink and white. Let's give y'all a sink. A bidet. A couple bidets for good measure. Some stuffy kins. And how about, of course, a wedding cake? It's not a wedding without a wedding cake, probably. And how about the most romantic creature of all? One ant. There we go. That looks pretty good. This is for when guests need to relieve themselves. Actually, I want Papa Bear in, in the corner. You guys are going to shit yourselves when you see how this turns out. It's going to be so good. You're going to shit your pants. It's going to, you're going to like sh shit yourselves when you see it. Poo your pants, probably. Wedding cake, front and center. And of course, the officiator of the wedding, the ant. Okay. What do we think? You guys ready to pose? Yeah, do you think it's good? Let's tie the knot. <laughs> this is so exciting. Oh, let's hear it. Yeah, absolutely. Yer. Okay, go ahead and pose, lovebirds. Um, <laughs> looks really good. Okay, what do you guys think? What do you think? That doesn't seem nice. Yeah, just look at the last one. Let's see it. Oh. My. Goodness. It's everything I could have wanted. Look at the ant just going like silly, goofy, stupid in the back. Somehow captured all the joy and love that my darling and I share. One amazing photo. I love it. Anyway, I have a little something to show our appreciation. That's not... Actually, you know what? Now that I'm like thinking about it, that could be really cute. To make a little like... <sighs> Like an outdoor wedding venue, maybe by the beach, for if anyone wants to get married on Scunion. I know I would. I thought they were gonna kiss, but instead they just looked at each other and rejoiced. I did your shit, dude. Heard you got some real groovy shots in there. Okay. All right, well, that's a good way to get some furniture. All right, noted. Bye. Dude, I just, I basically am the reason those two are getting married. <laughs> good afternoon. Let me get some water, Isabel. Let me get some water. So you're curious about the current image of Scunyan. Ah, okay, okay. So we we are moving up the ranks. I'm sure I'm sure the I'm sure the jump from four to five stars is the biggest, but nice to know that we are progressing. This is big. We're regular on many folks' list of top ten places they'd like to visit. Let's see. Back in my day, the key to a good life was a slow reset rate. You feel what I'm getting at? No. What I'm saying is this year's scunion you got going on? This is one sharp locale. What is that even? Well, there you have it. Compared with the last report, folks responded positively to our own scenery. Okay, so it's still, yeah, furniture. Ippy. Ippy. I like the way our island is looking. I like what we've got going on here. A shark. I'm not going to be able to catch it. Definitely not gonna be able to catch it, but let's try. Let's try to do it without taking the switch out of the dock. We did get it. It's not a shark. It's a sucker fish. Thought it was a shark. Oh wait, now I get it. Sucker. Shut up.